Okay, so an air rocket, this actually happened to us, okay? We launch it up, here's this light tower here. <laughs> or maybe it's a sentient being. Right, the air rocket goes up, comes down, somehow it comes down on top of the, air, uh, the light tower, right? And this is 9.50 meters. Um, and it strikes this with a speed. Notice I say speed, so I don't, I don't show that that's actually a negative number. If it's going down at 6.2, we're gonna make that negative. So the final velocity is negative 6.2 meters per second, right? The displacement from the ground to here is gonna be positive 9.5, okay? All right, so let's, let's set it up. We'll go from ground to the light tower. Okay, and we're going from the ground to the, to the top of the light tower. So our displacement is that we end up being 9.5 meters higher than we were. The initial velocity is unknown to us. The final, though, is negative 6.2 meters per second. Okay, so I put the minus sign on there because it's, it's hitting it on the way down. It had to be going down. And this is negative 9.81. And it says, what is the initial velocity? Um, how do we do that? I think we got to use no t to find that. So let's do that. b squared is u squared plus 2as. And then negative 6.2 squared. If you have a TI calculator, you must put that in parentheses and square it because it needs to be a positive number. Okay, equals u squared plus 2 times negative 9.81 times 9.5. Okay, so we solve this, right? Uh, 6.2 squared, uh, and then I'm going to subtract this term. So minus 2 times negative 9.81 times 9.5. And then I'm square rooting that. And I get that the absolute value of u is 14.994. Call 5604. Could you repeat that? Thank you. So that's our initial velocity, right? Um, and the question is, is it positive or negative? Well, they had to launch it upwards, so we're going to choose the positive value, right? Okay. So now we know the, the initial velocity, right? 14.994. And we know the final. We know the acceleration. Now we can find T with no S, okay? So V is U plus AT. Final velocity is negative 6.2. Initial velocity is 14.994. Oh, we would round that, by the way. If we had to round it to three sig figs, we'd say the initial velocity is positive 15.0. Okay? I'm just putting the plus on there to emphasize that, that it is going up, right? Okay? And then that's plus negative 9.81 times C. I'm just filling this in, right? Sorry for jumping around there. So I'm using this formula, V equals U plus AT. This is V, that's U. Okay, so let's see. Uh, da, da, da. And this time is 2.16048 seconds. So T is 2.16 seconds. And that's from the ground to the light tower. Okay. Um, yeah. All right.